Okay guys, welcome to the cabin. Gonna do a little cook up here. Cook a little lunch. Kind of a freezer cleaner outer kind of meal. <laughs> little bits of everything. Put it all in the pot, see what we end up with. Uh, it's very, very hot. I was planning to do an overnight in the cabin since the cabin arrived. It's just way too hot. Even right now it's uncomfortable hot, you know. Got a little tiny tarp which is too small. I'm going to put it up, try to get some shade and uh, hide behind it if I can. Get a fire going. Make a cup of tea. <laughs> get the priorities straight. Let's get a cup of tea. It is, other than hot, a beautiful day. Uh, it's the reason I wanted a cabin. Days like this, except maybe 10 degrees or so cooler would be nice. I don't know what the temperature is right now, but it's high 30s for sure, without a doubt. Uh, I don't know if it'll hit 40 today or not, but it'll be pretty close. And out in the sun, no, the problem when I brought the cabin in, I cut down, <laughs> I had to cut down half the trees. Lost all my shade, and that really changed everything here. So, uh, in the rainy season, we'll get planting and get some quick growing trees in here. Maybe next year, this time won't be nearly as bad. But right now, we're going to suffer through it. First thing, I guess, is to get the little tarp out, which is uh, too small, but it's what I got. I have to make it work. Not a person to be seen, yeah? I see a half a dozen cows, and that's it. Awesome. Eucalyptus leaves. When they go, they go quick. Woo! And hot. Cup of tea, cup of tea. Life will be better with a cup of tea. It always is. But the birds excited anyway. They want some tea as well. It seems. <laughs>
little bit frozen, that's why I put some water in it. Won't be frozen for long. Too many things in the way. There's a guy driving by here, selling beans. I tell ya, I think it's going to be one of those days. Everything is falling on the ground. Corn's a little strange. <laughs> like I said, I'm cleaning out the freezer. We have a terrible situation going on. We have too much food. The freezer is full. I really need a second one actually. So we're having corn with it. Oh, this will be put in with into uh, elbow macaroni a little bit later. Oh, oh that tea is good. Tea is really good. Okay, now, this is ground pork if I didn't say already. No ground beef in this, this part of the world. Beef is possible now. I see at, the, at Macro they have Australian beef and uh, Thai Wagyu. Thai Wagyu has always or has been around a long time. It's grown, I think they farm it in uh, Sakonakon which is not that far from here. 
but it was only ever exported and sold in restaurants in Bangkok. But now I see it's at the, at the macro. It's the cuts that nobody else wants. That's why, same with the Australian beef. It doesn't look very good. I can whack. But I haven't tried any of it. Uh, I've been burned on beef in Thailand too many times. I'll just stick with pork now. One day I'll get adventurous and try it. Be like a something exotic. <laughs> and duck. Eat a lot of duck. This fire to be in difficult. really close I think. What do you think? You should taste it, don't you? What do you think? <laughs> I only got the onion and corn. <laughs> That I have. No spice, huh? What was I thinking? Oh, that looks good. It's gonna be good. Think of that. Might be a lot of macaroni. <laughs> oh, hey, it's windy again. Hot. I got this. 
insulated canteen. This water's still cold, eh? And it's been sitting in the sun. I didn't even try and put it in the shade. Ow. Just needs a little bit of spice. <laughs> I eat so much spice that not having so much probably good for me. It's really good. Really, really good. I've been checking the temperature in the cabin. I need to bring a thermometer or something put in there. It's, it's not bad actually, considering that it's a million degrees outside, you know? Hot enough to fry your brain. I just might have to suffer it out one night and see what it's like. Uh, still haven't bought a bed. I'm looking at sofa beds. I can get them online, but honestly, they seem too cheap. <laughs> uh, I'd like to see one in a store somewhere to know what, you know how strong it actually is. I know. Uh, I bought a table. If you saw that on my workshop channel, I bought a table for here. I'm using it at home. Uh, for uh, cooking videos and workshop videos and it's I like it it's nice wood background it looks pretty good so I'm gonna buy another one for either here or for at home one of the two and I have a smaller about half the size plastic one it's a nice table but it's plastic that I might bring here in the in the meantime No rush. The only thing I'm in a rush for is the one thing that I can't change, and that's trees. Need some trees. Didn't bring a dog with me today. Don't want to take a chance of the dog running away again. <laughs> but it's their loss. I got lots of food. They'd be happy with this one. What's in here? Ground pork, onions, garlic, green onions. Uh, I got some tomato, processed tomato that I, I've been freezing my uh, my tomatoes from the garden. I had a little bit in the bottle. I brought that, I put that in here. A little bit of corn, a little bit of green onion, and some fresh tomatoes I just packed. I let them cook about halfway down and uh, it's pretty good. Maybe a little cheese on this would be nice. You want to get fancy, you know? I guess it's time to go home. It was <laughs> really, really windy there for a minute. It's uh, stop now. Wow. But sitting here, even though it's crazy hot, it's still uh, 
not a big deal. Just sitting here watching the world go by very slowly. Got everything all packed up. Just gotta put my box back in the truck. And I'm out of here. Out of Everybody spots my truck sitting there, so it's no secret that I'm here. <laughs> the truck sitting in the middle of the farm. Alright guys, there it is, my afternoon at the cabin. Been here oh three, three and a half hours I guess. Uh the only thing I did with my phone was check the weather. It's 36 degrees. Uh just sitting here enjoying it, you know enjoying being disconnected that's, that's why I like it here you know a little bit of banging going on somebody's building a roof or something uh, that away a few motorbikes and two cars I remember two cars going by that's it watch the neighbor come out and water his cows and uh, just enjoyed the birds really it's pretty awesome it's gonna be really nice here once once this gets treed out and you know get some good shade and more trees would be more birds and that's I see nothing wrong with that that'd be pretty good just sitting here right now the Sun is straight above so I got all this roof above me no Sun still warm but uh, when I was cooking outside, if I didn't have that little tarp, I don't think I would have done it. <laughs> it was just insane. Uh, the sun here is very, very powerful. It will burn you quick. All right, guys. Well, I'm going home. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed already, please do. We'll see you on the next one, whatever and whenever that might be. Lots of little birds around right now. Pretty cool.